Hi everyone, I'm JD. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm excited to share with you a new digital kit that I finally put up in my Etsy. This is a black cat digital kit and I did some watercolours. Um, and you might have seen me do these a process video of these on my channel um, quite a while ago. It's taken me forever to actually finally put it as a kit. But I just had so much fun painting black cats, <laughs> cat head, lots of cat heads. I think I did this one on my channel. And I actually did some painting with my cat too, Keanu. So I made this spot really, really wet with paint, put his paw in there and printed his paw prints. And this one came out the best. So cool. And you can see some other paw prints that he did. So we had fun painting together. This is his own artwork. He um, he spilt my water that I dipped my paintbrush in. So it was full of you know black water. He spilt it onto my floor. And so lucky the floor is tiles. I thought let's make use of this situation. And I just spread out all the, we got messy, spread out the water on the floor. And he dipped all four paws into the water. And then I laid out these watercolour sheets on the floor all over my room and he would just walk all over them and I would <laughs> dip his paws in and dip them onto the paper. And so this one he created himself though. He just did his all, walked all over it. This is one that I, I used his paw as a paw print type thing. So we had some fun painting together and you should have seen my floor. There were footprints everywhere. <laughs> And I did one of my hand so that I could do this. So with love from Keanu and JD. So I picked his best paw print with my hand print. And that's one of my thank you cards that I sent out with orders. <laughs> and so then, let me just get rid of these. Put them back in order. Um, the reason I did this, if you saw that video tribute to Ali Brown and her cat, um, her black cat, you understand why I did this. For two days I could not think about anything else, I couldn't do anything else. I was just so moved by that tribute and just didn't want to, want to take Keanu for granted so I wanted to paint him to capture him and always have him forever. I mean I know I've got photos and everything but it just helped me to be able to paint to deal with all my emotion and I did a tribute to him in my and Ali Brown and her cat Howard in my daily journal and this is one of the cards I printed so you can see how I use it as an actual journal card. Did some actual watercolours here. Another way I've used it is I used the one with this paw print here as a journal card. So just some ideas of ways you can use it in your own journals but um, this is what I did myself. I printed it out with a black border around each print so that it is get the Keanu hair off <laughs> so they're actual journal cards and I love them and I formatted them so blew up the hand the paw print bigger and I love this is my favorite card of them all and I combined three together how cute is that um, so in the digital, digital kit in my Etsy you will get the individual files by themselves so that you can format them however you want they don't have a black border and you can make them big or small, you can make them big pages or like a little card or a tag. But I also did include a, wor a Word document with the same printouts that I have. Um, in case you just want to print out the cards exactly as I have done it. So there's, there's two options for you. Not all of them are in the kit. As you can see I've got quite a lot of different images here. Some of them are for patrons only, so depending on their tier level. All, all of my patrons got this one as a thank you from me to them <laughs> um, and then as the tier goes up they get more and more obviously the $10 tier gets the whole kit plus more um, but in the kit there's 14 journal cards I love this one too with the paw prints in the corner and you could even format it this way so the paw prints go this way if you want a vertical card but this, you can have fun going nuts, arranging them however you want. Maybe it will help for documenting your own cat's life or if you want to do a cat journal, maybe these may help. <laughs> but for me, I guess even if no one else is interested, I have no idea if anyone will be interested in these 
in this kit <laughs> but for me it was very therapeutic for me I'm glad I did it for my own self and I have these cards forever to use in my own journaling I can use these in my thank you orders um, in my orders as a thank you card and so many uses and I can also have this paw print that's the main thing I want that paw print for the rest of my life to remember Keanu by um, and this is just kind of what it looks like printed and cut up so yeah, for me it's really exciting to have that on record. So I did small paw prints that's actual size and then I blew them up a bit bigger in that one. So I really like that one too. Um, and this one I combined, so this is his own artwork and then I put the cat head on top. Now I'm thinking I might combine his own artwork, put that in the background and put these images over the top as well. But I love the space for the journaling on these ones. So if you're interested, <laughs> I'll leave the link to Willowbound Journals below. Um, and yeah, let me know what you think. I just had so much fun doing that and I'm so glad I have this record now of my gorgeous black cat in paint form and that we did it together. <laughs> He's very crafty, very talented, very creative. <laughs> Not that he had um, balls of fun, but then I had to, you know, clean my entire floor <laughs> from his poor prints. <laughs> That's so cute. Anyway guys, I've rambled on long enough just wanted to show you that and hope you like it as well and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!